Welcome to VETS School of Public Health. Our school is ranked the best in the African region and is highly reputable in the world. We are known for innovative, high quality and relevant teaching, cutting edge research, as well as policy, service delivery and knowledge leadership in public health. This multidisciplinary school is considered an academic training center of choice in the region and beyond. It endeavors to continually produce and increase the pool of high quality, skilled public health graduates appropriately trained to address public health needs and challenges in South Africa and the African region. Over time, the school has created a reputation for excellence and relevance. This is partly because of the strong organizational structures and our extensive international collaborations on capacity building and research initiatives with our alumni and strategic partners. We also create an enabling environment for transformation, academic growth, and acquisition of new knowledge. I thank you for your support and look forward to your collective contribution so that we continue to excel and remain relevant. Court Health and Sociodemographic Surveillance System, located in the rural northeastern South Africa, close to the Mozambican border, provides a research platform for Rural Public Health and Health Transitions Research Unit of the Medical Research Council and the University of the Witwatersrand in South Africa. Its origins lie in the university's health system development unit that in the early 1990s focused on district health system development, sub-district health center networks and referral systems and training of clinically oriented primary health care nurses. The unit's mandate is to better understand the dynamics of health, population and social transitions in rural southern Africa in order to mount a more effective public health, public sector and social response. The Centre for Health Policy is one of the few multidisciplinary health policy units in South Africa and has over 20 years of research experience. The primary focus of their research is to support the development of the South African health system. As an academic research group, CHP actively seeks to draw together theoretical insights and empirical evidence in understanding health system change and in proposing strategies for future health system development. They conduct both independently funded research projects as well as commissioned research for the South African government and other South African organizations. They also support and engage with a variety of stakeholders to promote appropriate health policy analysis. CHP strives to advance the field of health policy by developing meaningful national and international relationships. Priceless Essay, an acronym for Priority Cost-Effective Lessons for System Strengthening South Africa, is a program that enables smart decisions about health investments in South Africa. They provide information that will improve the way in which resources are allocated and priorities are set for those individual interventions, clinical services and health technologies which affect population health. Because certain disease risk factors are responsible for the highest burden of disease, an understanding of which interventions are most effective in addressing these high burden conditions has considerable impact on population health. The aim of the initiative launched in 2009 is to support the development of evidence-based information and tools to determine how best to use existing scarce resources so that the health system works more effectively and efficiently. In performing this research, Priceless Essay engages with policymakers and strives to strengthen expertise in health economics. Analyses and evaluations are led by staff and are based on available secondary data from South Africa. What do you think are some of the challenges in public health? I think one of the greatest challenges in public health is huge social economic status disparities. The challenges in public health in South Africa are multifactorial. They don't fit neatly into the health industry itself on its own. 
They're compounded by things like poverty and lack of education. Um, these social determinants of disease impact majorly on the health status of individuals and therefore we have to work to find a way to reduce the impact that these things have on health care. How does data play an important role in public health? Data helps in public health because it provides us with existing records and these existing records are able to give us more information around dealing with outbreaks and finding better solutions. Data is crucial in any public health effort. In order to know what the problem is and how big the problem is, you need good quality data. There are several challenges and priorities in public health. What are yours? I think eliminating health disparities is one of the biggest priorities in public health. One of the most important priorities of public health is the re-establishment and thorough engagement with donors or funders so that they are able to request information and reporting methods that are possible for the countries and the regions to which they work in to better understand them.